Hello and welcome, my name is Romney and I'm the founder of Global Self Publishing. Thank you very much for joining me on my YouTube video today. Now I'm going to continue along with my series of videos where I outline some of the key tools you can use by using KD Spy. Now if you're not familiar with KD Spy, I do have a free download that you can look at, but basically it's a tool that you can use that helps you with niche research, keyword research and analytics, which would just take you a significant amount of time to extract if you were just to do it manually. But KD Spy really does help with all of your book publishing needs. But remember, if you do purchase KD Spy through my link, you'll also receive my $99 course about mastering KDP niche research for Amazon, absolutely free. So make sure you take advantage of that. Now, what we're going to do is go and look at the tools that are available, particularly the insights tool, which I think is a good focus point for us today. Let's get into it right now. So in one of my previous videos, we're looking at the keyword research tool, and we came across vegetable gardening in the Pacific Northwest, which with 127 results, gives you some pretty good analytics when you uh, plug it into KD Spy. So what we're gonna do is we're going to now look at the insights tool. So if we were looking at raised uh, bed gardening, all we need to do is go to insights. So when we click on insights, it'll bring up ChatGPT niche and genre insights. So what you need to do, if you want to look at the market intelligence report, we can click copy, demographics, trend analysis, market problems and questions, market dreams and goals. So you can also look at key success factors for nonfiction and fiction. Let me give you an example of what this information will provide for us when we look at ChatGPT. Let's look at trend analysis. So we click copy here and we go straight to ChatGPT. And today I'm going to be using ChatGPT4. So I've copied the prompt and all I do is control V and all it does is start to spit out all this information here. So you can see about the positive trends the growing interest in sustainable living, health and wellness, wellness factors or focuses. And what you can do is use this information to help create descriptions. You can use it for content within your book. You can look at the different information about sustainability and practicality. You can look at recommendations. All of this information is provided by ChatGPT based on that prompt from insights on the KD Spy tool. So what we might do while that keeps going, let's go back again and let's look at the market intelligence report. So we go copy and we're going to go back to ChatGPT. So that's um, provided us with all that information initially. Now let's look at this one. So put the prompt in and let's go for it. So this will now provide us with that market intelligence report based on the prompt, which is already there for us. So the great thing is it'll provide related keywords. So these are different keywords that you might like to look for book titles using for Amazon ads. You can also look at the target audience. So when you're creating your book, you know who the primary and secondary targets are. You look at the market size and growth. You can also look at book titles with recurring patterns and themes, and you can have a bit of a research into these different ones as well. It really does provide a great overview. As I said, gives you related keywords. It also provides you with uh, the different insights and trends. And that, res that really does help. Let's look at one last one. Let's look at uh, maybe demographics. So we copy this one. We go back to ChatGPT. And we're going to plug in the prompt, Control-V, and we look at this one right now. So we scroll right down, Market Intelligence Report. This will give us, did I look at that before? I can't remember. I don't think I did. I think I might have. <laughs> I've done it twice. Let's go back and do this again. We're going to stop this right here. We're going to do a market dreams and goals this will be an interesting one let's go back here let's plug in that one and let's see what this does 
So comprehensive report on target readers for raised bear gardening and companion planting. This is great, where it provides a target reader report. It gives you probably even different chapters that you might like to use. So once you've created uh, this commentary within ChatGPT, we can then also ask it to, uh, so based, provide a chapter book. Remember, it's just an outline and we need to look at different ways that we can create the description so it's not just AI generated. We've got a personal human touch about it. So this is the book description, the beginner's guide to raised garden bedding, companion planting. So it'll go through the chap book outline It'll provide the introduction, the fundamental, designing a raised garden bed, selecting the right plants, organic gardening techniques, maximizing your garden's potential, the garden as a sanctuary, advanced tips and innovations. You might like to get some other different chapters. And what I'd recommend you do is go back to this area here and have a bit of a look of the books that are tracking well and what they have as part of their chapter breakdowns so you can have a look at any one of these ones so let's look at one that's doing quite well so let's go down to uh, let's have a look just look at this one's here this is a bestseller and you can see the different photos that are being used You can see the different companions and different photographs are being used. Then you can see the A plus content. So that's from the publisher. You can see how they've used that information really clearly. Editorial reviews. And we scroll down and we can even see the different um, images and what's included in the contents. So that will give you a really good. So it's got ground rules, journal pages vegetables part two growing concerns so you can see the contents and you might be able to look at what they have included in this book and be able to create a book yourself but that's just the insights tool that you can use for KD spy and it is a wonderful way of doing it if you wanted to have a look at this book a bit further you can do a KD spy research just on this book alone and that will provide an ability to track it, which we'll cover in a future lesson. So there we have it. That's the ability to look at um, or to use the ChatGP tool in conjunction with KD Spy to be able to do that research to really hone in on whether this book is something that you should focus on. And then you can also use the AI technology to help you come up with a book outline description. So that's based on vegetable gardening in the Pacific Northwest. As I said, you use the KD Spy tool that will come up with all the different um, analytics for you. What I normally do, if I go sales rank, I normally get rid of one, two, three, because they might be books that haven't been produced very well and are obscuring the data. Then this will give you the overall average sales rank. You can also look at the reviews and you can see that this book here, Growing Berries and Fruit Trees, then it's got a reviews, 61 reviews, 85, 700 sales rank. You can actually have a look at what the cover looks like by clicking on the C and you can see Growing Berries and Fruit Trees in the Pacific Northwest. The Pacific Northwest seems to be a keyword that's quite popular but it doesn't have a huge amount of competition, which is probably something that you can look at. So popularity, green, potential, green, competition, green. Total monthly revenue for these books is nearly $160,000. And we're looking at the books. If you're into audiobooks, you can also look at those as well. There's not a lot of competition there. And you can also pull further results from 21 to 40. And it'll be interesting to see from results to 1, 1 to 40, if we've still got green lights that are showing for our popularity, potential, and competition. There we go. So we can scroll down further. What I normally do, 
do the filter, scroll down, get rid of the first three or four, because we've got 40 results now. And then you can see the sales ranks a bit higher because there's some other books here that are particularly doing well. But if we do the reviews, we know we can probably compete with books that are under about 150 reviews. So we can scroll down here and we can actually see what it is. So Pacific Northwest Native Plant uh, Primer. So you can have a look at what those books are about. You click on that and it will take you directly to the book. So I hope this insights tool has helped you. You can go there, copy the prompt, and then you can go straight to ChatGPT, plug in the prompt, and it will give you all of that market intelligence and information that you're looking for in one simple move. Okay, I hope that's helped.